Mr. Math here, thanks for watching my videos. Be sure to like and subscribe and remember to click the bell icon to be notified of updates. Okay. So three of these and hope I don't get a rare blade from the first two. That looks suspicious. Oh, for the... This game is determined not to cooperate. <sighs> well, <clears throat> hello viewers, welcome back to Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I decided to start by trying to get the final pity blade, <laughs> and didn't. Again! <laughs> I keep getting bad luck with good luck. It's... <laughs> Cora, a healer. Knuckle Claws. Let's see. Lock picking. Well, that's something I've been needing, actually. How do you like that? Hmm. Okay. Well, can't complain about that. Okay, well, and she's on Nia, which is a good thing, in my opinion. <sighs> Don't set, thank you very much. Well, time to give up again. <laughs> Man, this is just... Alright, let's get some more info. Okay, looks like her various key affinities just require trust. No uh, special quests or anything like that. And okay, her level 3 special restores 30% of the damage dealt to the whole party. So there's healing for you. Potion Hoarder. Extends time HP potions remain on the ground by 60 seconds. Hmm. Girls Talk, Electric Mastery, Lock Picking. Yeah, I've been needing more lock picking. Rock has that on Vandom, but... That's the only one, I think. And now I have two. Okay, that, that's good. Well, uh, I really wanted that other pity blade. I know who it is, and she would be pretty good on Rex, but the game is determined to not let me have her. Oh, boy. At this rate, I'm going to get her from a random um, core crystal pole.
before I ever make enough pity points. <laughs> well, once again, I start another episode with failure. <laughs> well, I even removed Nia's luck accessory just to make it less likely to get a rare blade. I mean, for goodness sake. Or where was it? It was a bonnet choker. You know, more luck. Good for getting status effects to, to stick. So, you know, I'm constantly having Nia cat perform her break art. So, yeah, more luck helps with that. And it also helps get you rare blades more often than not. But, <sighs> I didn't want that, so I removed the luck accessory and uh, it didn't work. All right. Well, anyway. So, here we are in Araya on our way to Fonsamima. And Fonsamima is up that away. But there's something optional over here that I would like to see. Is that a collection point? No, kind of looked like a collection point. That's a collection point right up ahead. Lots of ignas in the area. What have we here? Flora heals an aching soul. Okay. Let's see if I can just kind of slip on by them like this. Did that work? I could take them easily. They wouldn't be a challenge, but yeah, I'm getting kind of bored of fighting all of these things around here. What have we here? So if I can just slip past all of these guys, that would definitely be preferred. More ignorance, okay. Aren't those birds? Oh yeah, there are some birds there. I was going to say, I thought those were birds sitting over there. There's some birds further off that direction, and then the Ign is a bit closer. Okay. Nice to know my eyes are still working. Kind of going into dangerous territory here. Those flying fish over there are like level 40. I don't want to try to take them on right, n right now. But I do still want to go through here. Uh, and this little guy, this is a Pepito, I believe. Yeah. Come out, come out. Pepitos have an annoying tendency to run away. They're basically the metal slimes of this game. <clears throat> you get in fights with them, and they are very evasive, and then run away. And these Pepitos will summon one of those things if they're able to run from battle. Definitely want to avoid that if at all possible. Wow! World has many amazing places in it! Okay. Perhaps rest and enjoy view for a bit. Yeah, this is where I wanted to get to. I just wanted to open up this place on the map, the skip travel point. You're all mine. And I want to go talk to Tanini over there. More common core crystals that I can try and fail with later. Tanini! Hey! Hello! Tanini have question for experienced adventurer like friends. Friends think juice made with late blue ladybird be tasty tasty? In real life? Sounds disgusting. But, hey, I don't know. The game In the game world, blue ladybirds might be f like they might taste like uh, caramel for all I know so sure sounds tasty friends think so too this juice will be ultra popular eclipse even shiny success of famous twinkle juice soon 12 brother sister pond be most popular drinks place in all Argentum once again oh yes Tanini have other brother ponds and sister ponds also searching for tasty tasty ingredients maybe friends meet them during travel make sure to say hello lo, if yes bye bye now All right, so that's that taken care of. Let's get the heck out of here. 
Hmm. Now that I think about it, there's one of the twelve brother sister pawns in Gormont that I don't remember if I've actually talked to him yet. No reason why we can't check real quick. Uh, let's see. Up a level right. Mm. It's pretty close to Lasham Island, but I don't actually want to go to Lasham Island. Let's go to the Way Tree. That's not too far away. Yeah, Lasham Island is loaded up with level 40 monsters. That was a slog. Let us go. Okay, textures popping. There we go. All right. Let's see. Should be a bit over here. Come out! Come out! Flora heals an aching soul. I don't remember exactly where it is, but it's actually on a lower ledge, over the edge, kind of in this general direction. Can I thread the needle and get through these uh, hostile monsters? There we go. Now, where was it? Right down there. I do not remember oh. if I've been here yet. Looks like I have, because the uh, brother-sister pawn in question is not here. Okay. What have we here? All right. I did find the one here. All right, back to Araya. To the stomach. And let's go to the tardy gate. From here, it should be a short hop up to Font Semima. Well, there. long journeys make Dora tired. What will we find? Not a short hop, pretty long hop, but the way is more or less clear. No, uh. we lost the upper hand. Oh, and of course that stupid bunnet aggro on Okay, here we go. Why not? Why not? Let's see if I can get up to level 3. Okay, level 3. Awesome. Uh, I Alright, Tora. Do your special on the bonnet. Helmet makes for quite a snug berth, my boy. It's not my fault if you fall out during battle, yeah? The rest of these bunnets are minding their own business. Side quest. Not one I want to do. I know which side quest it is, and I don't want to do it. Thanks, but no thanks. Maybe it's later. It's a new day, everyone. Good morning. Rise and shine. Lots of big guys around here. Hmm. 
little guys as well. Let's see if I can thread the needle on these lots. Uh, more Ignas. You'd think they'd be keen to mind their own business because we are pretty high level. But no, they're quite happy to bother us if we get close enough. Oh, and a team of drivers. With one that who qualifies as a unique monster. Hmm. Now I just want to get to Fonsamima. Hey, look what I found! Congratulations! Alright, we're not too far away. Now we need to go that way, to the right, to get up there. But I'm not entirely sure what's over here, so I want to take a look. Funny Stone Highway. Funny as in ha ha, look at that funny stone. Okay, if you say so. Oh, this is just a few cul-de-sacs that lead me right back around to the same place. Hmm. Come out, come out! Okay. Actually, what level am I right now? 24, 23, 23, 25. That's plenty good enough. On to Fontamima. Here we go. Almost made it. The Gwyneth Patties. In Fonsamima they grow rice. There's uh, collection points. Here's one of them. Come out, come out! Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? Mm -hmm. Lots of grom rice. Well, not lots of it, but... Some. This patty's for growing grom rice. Grom rice is the Orion staple food. It's cultivated enthusiastically in the capital of Fonsamima. The interesting thing is, its name changes depending on how you cook it. If you knead it and finely chop it, that's called Fidel. Or you can flatten it out, then it's Aglarna. Oh, right. To think I'm supporting Orion food culture gives me such a buzz. Well, I'm glad you enjoy your work. Keep at it. What have we here? Isn't it great we can get all this stuff right out of the ground? What is that old saying that if you love what you do, you'll never work a day in your life? And the cutscene. It is a pretty grand looking city, isn't it? program. That's a lot of warships. These ships look different to normal ships. Yeah, we don't muck about with our Titans much. No need for it. Orion's like things pretty natural. 
I've seen your iron ships before, back in Argentum. It's like the total opposite of how the Ardanians use them. There could be one reason. They're always at each other's throats. They've been like cats and dogs for a long time. Well, from where I stand, the Adanians are worse. All that metal is just bad taste. It's easy to think that way. But you're not considering how the Titans themselves feel. Huh? Don't all those modifications hurt? When Titans live with humans, that's just the way it is. Hmm. I used to have a pot on my back and a crane stuck where the sun doesn't shine. I never complained, not even when Rex fired up a grill on my shoulders. Hey, you used to like that. Hmm. Well, yes, I did like that. In fact, I miss it. If I did that now, we'd end up with Rose Titan. Indeed. <laughs> Okay. Let's go check out the dock. There's a side quest over there. Tora, want to hear gossip? What was more ordained could easily break out at any time. That's why we're stocking up the Titan battleship with food rations. If the Empire makes make a move to expand their territory, only Uriah will be able to stop them. So we must always be on our guard for the sake of other nations as well. I mean, sure. But, you know, other nations sometimes welcome the help. It's not always aggression. Often, yes, but not always. Anyway, helping those other nations is really just an excuse. Treasure acquired. Okay. So if I remember correctly, this guy's side quest has to do with salvaging. Got any interesting info? Oh, absolutely. I've heard something a driver would definitely find real interesting. It's a rumor about a Titan ship packed to its rafters with boosters that sank on its way to Endor. It was a long time ago, but I hear its final resting place is not too far from Gormas Lasham Island. Any salvager worth their salt should be able to get to the boosters without too much trouble, but what's that guy doing? You know, it's rather rude to walk right between people having a conversation like that. <laughs> hey, stop trying to shove me out of the way. No matter, jerk. There. <clears throat> anyway, any salvager worth their salt should be able to get to the boosters without too much trouble, but you might not know that salvaging boosters require special tools. There's an opon in the back streets of this here town who go who knows about these things goes by the seesaw. Thank you so much. You have my gratitude all- Ugh. Now he's pushing Gromark around. Ah, don't mention it. I don't have the aptitude to be a driver, so I don't mind sharing that info with you. If I was a driver myself, well, that'd be a whole different story. Let's not make that the active quest for now. I guess I don't have an active side quest, do I? Wait a second, haven't I done this? No. Huh. Wow, I never found that peony stone. Huh? <laughs> That's been on the back burner for a while. Eh, whatever. It can stay there for a while longer. Let's go ahead and make this one the active quest. See if I can find that uh, Nopon. Looks like he's not too far away, this Nopon. Oh, I thought that guy up there 
who had the word bubble over his head was this guy. Eh, that's perspective for you. You can kind of mess things up sometimes. Hi there. Fellow mercenaries, are you? Fonsa Mime is in a state of panic preparing for the war to come. Make sure you don't stand out too much in case the army drafts you into their ranks. Well, I figure we'll all get dragged into it somehow eventually. Araya's armed forces are essentially made up of both the regular army and the mercenaries. And coming and come wartime, us mercs will be swimming in gold. Yeah, that's the reality of war hey, sometimes. Look what I found! Congratulations! And we found the commercial district. What's that? It's a distribution center. The government tries to ration out what little resources they have. In practice, it's just first come, first served. Okay, that's the last one for today. <gasps> Come on! I'm a soldier. Been busting my gut for this country. That should be going to me! Not the likes of you! Huh? Don't look at me like that. Respect your elders, you snot-nosed brat! Are you okay? What do you think you're doing? She's just a child. What? Huh? Huh? Who the hell are you? Rex, this isn't our business. Leave it. <sighs> Being an adult isn't just about barking orders. Sometimes you need to help someone weaker. Uh, shut your face! You don't know what the hell you're talking about! And those soldiers back there aren't doing jack about Let's this. Show them a thing or three. <laughs> Rolling snap! What the? You fight puppy! What the? You can't do that! Snap! What the? Cut down! Smash! Yep! No effect! Go! Hey, the deflector! Get down! Now, let's show them what I really mean! Rolling smash! This guy is pretty evasive. Okay, here we go. Why not? Okay, Thor, get to your level three, please. Okay, Thor, level three. Okay, I got my level three. Sorry. <laughs> Too late. Okay. Chain attack. Where up, Gramps? All right. Um, not ideal. If I had uh, an electric blade or an ice blade, that would be better. But well, I'll have to make do. Pyra, I've got this. No, you fight, Poppy. Get him, Nia. On it. Uh, okay. Percent. On you go. Go, great stuff. Begin. Okay, Poppy, please go for the wind orb. Go, go, go! Poppy, Poppy, 
Yes! That was luck. Okay. Sure, Boris. I'm not really in the mood to do much. Get him, Mia. On it. Dromar. Let us settle this. Oh, magnificent. I love how he keeps saying, ow. Tora right here. Naponic storm. Magnificent. Let's keep it up. Magnificent. Okay. Pyra. I've got to keep out. Ouch. Magnificent. Get him, Mia. Here I can ready or go multi. Magnificent. Tora, Poppy, Yora. Tora right here. Poppy Alpha operating. Magnificent. Much, much stronger. Okay, Mia leveled up. Who are you? The 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 color of that crystal? You? Not good. He'll be bringing others before long. The rumors about Pyra must have traveled pretty far. Even grunts like him have heard him. Sorry. I guess I should have used the cloak. But who spread rumors? From what I hear, it's some fancy pants Nopon merchant. A Nopon merchant? Excuse me, Mr. Van Dam. Huh? Oh, well, if it isn't my owner! You grew a fair bit. How's Grandpa Cole doing? Ah. Not too good, then. Who's this? Huh? Oh, this is Iona. That old friend of mine takes care of her. Hi, Iona. Great to meet you. Come on, let's beat it before those soldiers show up. Probably a good idea. Although we can take some time to uh, do some shopping. Oh, she's already got her level four. Wow. I still have a little ways to go to get Pyra's key affinity up. Boreas, that's going to take some real doing. It's not hard, it's just expensive. Even if I don't pay the 100000 to get into the warehouse, it's still not cheap. And what does Dromark need to do again? Oh yeah, he just needs meat. I have a great idea for a new firework. And, and I still need to do more salvaging to get Poppy going here. Alright. Well, it just so happens we can buy some meat here. I think I already have a meat dish, and I need four of them for drone park. So, if I just go to the pouch... Oh, I don't want to erase a Narsipare jelly, especially when it's, there's still almost half of it left. Okay, this can keep. Alright, let's see. Ruban. What do you want, youngin? I'm done with my mercenary consultation sessions for today. Oh, you're not mercenaries? Sorry then, guess I got the wrong idea. I'd still be glad to lend you a word of advice if there's anything troubling you mind. I used to be the leader of a mercenary band, you see, so I know a thing or two. Okay, 
Okay, well, I can come and talk to him every now and then. Alright. I'm asking for rations again today. Because of the war, the Orion army is restricting sales of food and things are getting more and more expensive. I just can't get vegetables like I used to. But it's all going toward Orion's victory in the war. And there's lots of people working as soldiers and mercenaries in Fonsamima. That includes a lot of people I know. We all have to do our bit. Cosmetics, ox cores. And do I have any I can improve? Well, yes, I do. Do I have any that are worth improving, perhaps? Hmm. That... That would be good for Poppy, except that she doesn't use ox cores. Critical up? Yeah, for someone like Pyra, that would be pretty good. Let's see, elemental defenses. Seeing light opening arc one increases damage dealt by 100% for the first driver arc per battle. That could be useful, although it's only for the first driver arc, so that's pretty limited. Outdoor attack up. Okay, now that that's a good one. Increases damage dealt outdoors by 20%, and like even here in Uriah. You might think, since we're inside the Titan, that it wouldn't work here, but it, but no, this is considered outdoor by the game. It's only when you're actually inside a building with an artificial roof over your head that you are indoors. So, outdoor attack up is... Okay, not just an artificial building, also caves, I think. You know, small caves also qualify, but... Inside Uriah like this, uh, it's still considered outdoors. So let's see, I don't have an awful lot of things, but I do have more than enough, so sure. And let's get another one. Blade resist that could come in handy. Hmm. Yeah, that's about it for now. Okay, let's see. Briarly trading. Very little salvaging in the Rye. Yeah, there's no salvage points here. Unfortunately, I don't have anything I can sell this guy. Alright. Malbrin salvaging. Vintage cylinders, huh? Yeah, not worth buying them here, though. I can get them less expensive back in Gormont or even Argentum. And you know what? Now that I think about it, completely randomly, I want to switch Nia's blade setup. I'm going to go ahead and give her Korra. It's been a long time coming. Always cute and fierce, though. Not necessarily because I think Korra's better than Crosset, but because the lightning element would come in very handy. So let's set her up with a few things. 
Amethyst chip. Yeah. Well, there's something to be said for both of these. Lower auto attack. You know, healer blades, you're not going to worry about attacking with them so much. So their attack power isn't all that important. But look at that critical rate. And you know, doing critical hits, that's usually pretty good. On the other hand, this one has the special effect of increasing Nia's HP by 500. You know what? Let's just go ahead with that. Alright. So that's done. And now, Ox Cores. Heck, let's give her one of those outdoor attack ups. Increases damage dealt outdoors by 20%. And a critical up? Nah, not important. Fusion combo up. You know, I really wish I knew precisely what that meant. Boost, boost fusion combo effect by 10%. You know, not damage, like the blade combo boost, but effect. So... It doesn't do more damage, necessarily. I'm not sure what that means. Well, let's go with the blade combo boost. I'm I'm equipping her mainly to get better blade combos. You know, getting... Having electric... That'll... That can only come in handy. I mean... Before, I had Crosset here. But I already had Fire, what with Pyra. And... Since Tora applies the Earth element, and in this game, Electric is opposed to Earth, this makes it easier to burst those Earth orbs. So yeah, I think that's good. Board games? Uh, da -da 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 -da. Noel, huh? Hello, friend. Don't see a lot of Ardanians on the streets of Araya, do you? My husband's an Orion. He works as a mercenary. My dad's in the mercenary business, too, so that's how we originally met. Oh, right. He tells me about his fights every day. Some enemies can only defeat... can only defend in certain directions, to the front only, or the front and sides. His stories get a bit bloody, but I've got a strong stomach, so we get on well. That must be stressful sometimes, being an Ardanian married to an Orion. The locals might not have much uh, love for this poor lady. Welcome, friend. Fontamima is sometimes known as the City of Art. Does, our, does any of our artwork entice you? Well, I can't actually see it, so unfortunately, no. Let's see, and where is that Napa? Over in this general direction. Dog Ant? Hello, friend. Found some Imo's Capital of the Arts. Even a no-name landscape artist like me, working day in and day out with no sales, can find some respect. My worries now are of a different kind. You see, the distribution center has sprung up in this square. It wasn't there when I started painting this scene. It won't be long before war with Moradine breaks out. I can feel it. Brian, what do you want? You! Hey, you! You over there! You've inspired me deeply in a way I can scarcely describe. Something wrong. Ah, what a dashing profile. I'd love to try and capture it with a sketch or two. But as much as I'd love to immortalize you in art, I actually have a more pressing request. Now this I have to hear. I was working on some landscapes. I got a bit carried away and before I knew it I was out of paint. I can only use special paints of the highest quality. Actually, I concoct them myself. 
You need the right ingredients for really vivid color. It's the foundation that my very work is based upon. I asked my mercenary buddy to try and find some, but I couldn't afford the fee. This conflict with more ordained has really made things expensive. Too expensive for an impoverished artist like myself, anyhow. But just when I thought things were hopeless, you appeared before me. Yes, I would call it fate. Destiny is like the artwork of the gods. If I may, I would like to ask you to find me the ingredients that constitute my paints. I'm afraid I cannot offer cash, but I will surely find you something valuable in return for your services. Does my offer please you? Will you accept? We'll give it our best shot. Many thanks. What I require is some crust tip chitin and tricolor rock. I dare say the crust tip chitin can be had by filling a crim crust tip at Farlane Wells. Tricolor rock can be found in rocky parts of Araya. A thousand thanks. Yeah. Oh, I didn't want to make that the active quest. Darn it. I wanted to keep the knob on. Uh, darn it. <laughs> I just don't think and do things by rote like that. Okay, so where was that knob on? He was kind of sort of in that general direction. Down there, I imagine. Okay. Shortcut! So it looks like he's up. Oh, darn it. How do I get up? How do I get up there? Fine, how do you do? Okay. Let's find another way. Hmm. That looks like an alleyway over there. Maybe that's the way in. How do I get up there? Wow, okay. I'm completely lost. I guess that's not the right word. I'm not lost. I know exactly where I am. Here we go. restaurant in Font of Mime, if I do say so myself. Oh, we get some drongos in here, so it's more of a pub than anything. There are a lot of places like this in Font Mime. All the mercs who get off duty come in and eat to eat and booze and just have a laugh and let their hair down. Also gives them a chance to talk about their next assignments. Hope you fit in here. I get in there. So this is the way in that I came into town. Perhaps over here. place either. Hey, a sweet shop. That's useful. My little brother Vera was such a crybaby. This one time he tripped and skinned his knee the tiniest bit, but he was bawling about it for hours. I don't see how he's going to handle being an Orion soldier. The only thing he's good at is studying, really. I'm kind of worried about him. They say there are some monsters that encourage their buddies to make them stronger. If I was in a fight like that, I reckon it'd be best to take out the one that was doing the encouragement, first of all. 
I heard that from one of my dad's driver buddies. You gotta study up if you want to join the Orion army, you know. What desserts do you have? Rainbow Parfait and Blossom Custard. Well. Oh wait, that's just recharged by point one. Never mind. Point three, that's better. Okay. That'll be useful. I just don't know how to get up there. Right now we discussing amongst our among selves about how to obtain merchandise cheaper and lower prices. We think long and hard about how to help poor people living in Torica Alley. Only conclusion we come to so far is to boost economy. If everyone buy lots of products from us, that mean more demand. Which mean, in turn, we get to produce more and price of goods go down. So in short, purchase of more products help develop country. And as country develop, commodities get cheaper. So basically increase the, de the dev level of these places. So the knock one I need to talk to is up, it would appear. Right up there, in fact. But I don't know how to get over there. Maybe I have to go a little higher. Remember there's an accessory shop around here somewhere. Up. Oh, here's the main quest location. Hmm. Is this some kind of theater? Yeah. It's a theater, all right. The guy we're here for leads the troop here. Ah, actors, eh? And right now, they're in the middle of a show. Well, you want to take a quick peek? The heroic adventures of Adam. Might be interesting. I've never been to the theater before. Neither has Tora. Let's do it. Nice and quiet, though. Looks like it's pretty packed today. Okay. <laughs> Interesting how it focused in on Pyra there when they mentioned Adam. And I saw at that time that the powers of darkness had engulfed almost everything. People and titans alike were drawn into the abyssal vortex. The apocalypse was upon us. The end was nigh. But then... Despite the wounds all over his body, the great Adam stood! O oh, Architect, grant me power! Power to banish the dark, power to illuminate the world! Lo, loyal servant of the Architect, the Aegis! O oh, Aegis, bless me with your power! Bring light upon the world! Thus they defeated the darkness! 
but at a terrible price. Three great continents sank beneath the sea of clouds forever. Servant of the Architect, by thy power, the world is saved. For the gift you have granted us, we are eternally grateful. I shall spread thy legend far and wide. May your name live on for eternity. off unintentionally there. Such a great play. So sad, but uplifting, too. They've been performing the heroic adventures of Adam ever since I was a child, you know. It's amazing that we keep a tale from 500 years ago going like we do. Okay. So, we could continue with the main quest, but let's... This looks promising. Seesaw. Yeah, that's who I'm after, isn't it? Huh. Hey ho! Friends have business with Seesaw? Let Tora explain. Oh, that story? His old, uh, chestnut, yes. Which is to say, Seesaw talk about needing special cylinders to salvage boosters from Cloud Sea, yes. Never thought would see day when someone here in Oriah want to salvage that, though. Big surprise, yes. Really is Cousin Pana Seesaw who live in Argentum who know all about this stuff, but Seesaw try to help. If friends bring materials, me take good old college try at making. First of all, need one silver cylinder for use as base. Then zigzag shaft. Can salvage up in Argentum if somewhat lucky. Lastly, but not leastly, salvageable item from Gormont, Locust Spring. No, no, better make it two. With those materials, Seesaw make booster cylinder, just like Cousin Pontot. Okay. And I already have all that. Well, <laughs> that's useful. Friends bring Seesaw materials for make booster cylinder? Wait, I don't? Huh, okay. Where did she say the zigzag shaft could be found? Was that Argentum? Uh, well, that's disappointing. I thought the game was saying I already had the stuff. Oh, informant. Seems you got questions for me. Just grease my palm and I'll sing like a canary. Affinity, driver combat, enemy detection, fusion combos, driver combat, blaze personality, unique monsters, RIP, heart to hearts, shackling blades. Eh, nothing I need to know. At least not from this guy. Airflow. The wind is my mate. Copy boosters engaged. Hmm. Okay. Let's find out where this goes. As long as I'm up here. Hey! You're the boss! You're the boss! I'm Bruce Springsteen? That's kind of you to say so. Um. 
I have to say, not very many people mistake me for Bruce Springsteen, but I'm flattered, I guess. Useful, right? The wind is my mate. Poppy boosters engaged. Oh, ho Treasure. Treasure acquired. Coochie, coochie, coo! Open up! <laughs> Calm your mind. <laughs> okay, thank you, Cora. That was entertaining. And profitable. Oh. Wasn't there another one over here? Yes, there was. Useful, right? The wind is my mate. Oh, I don't have enough Happy of this one. boosters engaged. Wow. I need one more level of wind mastery. Hmm. Okay, I can't put anyone else on Rex. How about Nia? I don't know if she has any wind blades. She does. Okay. And he has wind mastery. I'll shine on the front line too. Useful, right? I think I'll show you my power. The wind is my mate. Poppy boosters engaged. Popono. Hmm. What's the deal with this guy? Friends seen red barrels around town. Those handled by Nopon Trade Guild. They marked with red paint so they're easy to keep track of. Actually, not just Argentum Trade Guild that use them. They have nationwide application. Sometimes we try to make sure they under lock and key. But vandalism of barrels on rise lately is getting a bit worrying. <laughs> okay, that's interesting information. But I kind of already knew that. And anyway, is that really all? That airflow down there just for this? Okay. Okay. Nope. I didn't want to talk to him again. I wanted to jump off. Alright then. Now, if I go into the back of the playhouse, it'll move the main quest along. Awful lot of blades. Weapon skills are a bit basic, though. If you stick with the same weapon throughout a lot of battles, and your skills are sure to grow. Make your arts a lot stronger. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. I don't really want to move along the main quest, because if I do, then things will start really moving along. There are a couple side quests I could see, too. This one right here, True Colors. I need that Crust Tip Chitin. And it's quite a long way away, but we have this wonderful thing called Skip Travel. So, if I make that the uh, quest on... Active quest, and then head out to Yurn of the Elderwood. I'll be pretty close to a whole bunch of these guys. I only need four of them. We're here. So, shall we? And let's see. The first one is right over there. That level twenty-one monster over there. Oh, and I need to reset my blades because I picked out a bunch with Wind Mastery. Who did I have before? It was Boreas, wasn't it? Yep. Just leave it to Boreas. Hmm. There's not much I can do with Boreas right now besides the, um, uh, the wind, um, blade combos. And, I mean, that's useful, but you know what? I'm 
Back to battle. I'd like to do some more with Percival here. Just because, really. And then Nia... Let's send you back to uh, Cora here. It's been a long time coming. Always cute and fierce, though. All right, so... I haven't done anything with Percival yet, so he needs a courtship. He's a tank, so he's more about block rate than critical. But he's an evasion tank. Uh, I mean, to upgrade him, I'm going to lose some block rate. But he's an... Chroma Katanas are evasion tanks rather than, you know, sponge, damage sponge tanks. Increases accuracy during the night by 50%. Well, I think it is currently the night. Oh, and of course... Ox horse. He only has one? Really? Okay. Outdoor attack up. Fusion combo, blah, blah, blah. Aggro boost increases aggro drawn from auto attacks. You know what? No, let's forget all that. Just increase the damage he does. Outdoor attack up. All right. Okay, time to take you down. We can you fire, can are you? It, Rex, Rex. Let's keep Rex. this up smart. Yeah. For sure. Rex. I like your attitude. Spinning cutter. Topple up. Eagle Spinning! Ah. Cutter! Okay. Why not? can do it! Dora will show them! Rush down! So Everyone's getting psyched! Oh, it's locked! Gotcha! Too bad I don't have a Cora, if you can get your level 3, I'd really appreciate it. Yes, Poppy, you will. Awesome. Mega eruption topple. Mega eruption topple. I believe I don't actually have an art that can inflict the smash effect, which is the last step of the driver combo. All right. So now I need another prim crust dip. Should be one fairly close over this way. I think. Um. Hmm. Okay, bring what? it up. Okay. Got a fish coming out. I like your attitude. Top of them. That doesn't make you feel I up. It's a word, and I can just hit it. This is where we prove ourselves. Just why not? You don't stand a chance of having a smash. Yeah, top of the top. Top. Right. 
do this. Why not? Why not? So, hmm. In this direction, it would appear. Ah, there's one right there. Show them a thing or three. We can do this together. Oh, come on. Go away. Rolling smash. Let's keep... This won't do. Don't give up on me. Anchor shot. Hey, guys, let's focus on the one monster, please. Let's give him the full treatment. Let's get him the full one more. No, 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 no. Make haste and retreat. Great right again. No, my flames strike true. Blade combo, third stage. Awesome. Okay. Got rid of him. Four. Of course, you can get up to level two, then Nia can finish off with her level three. Oh. He didn't last that long. Okay. That works for me too. Okay, there's another one right over there. And then there should be yet another one sort of that way. Okay, time to take Our these guys. Are in tomb, right? Tora, Rolling smash. Break Eagle No, you sure. You fight Poppy. Okay. Stand Stand up. Up. This, this is where you spend your life. Go for it. Let's do it. Steady. Why not? Man. I'm Eagle Lock. Spinning. Why not? Rolling smash. Spinning. These things don't know when to leave me alone. Blast of birds. Mia, if you could please get up to level two. Let's do my level three. Got a break art. Easy peasy. Tora could even beat them without friends. Okay. I was trying to get Nia to finish the blade combo, but I didn't get it fast enough, unfortunately. Alright, now there's another of these first it's over right over there. Okay. And while I'm at it, there's a uh, gather point right here. Okay, bring it up. Really? Rolling smash! Our 
Make your You don't stand a chance of getting So fast! Right there now. Rolling smile! I'm just I'm just I'm No! Our are in two, Rex. My goal is exactly. Let's get Yeah. So Ha! Just shot. 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 Just no! What? We lost the upper hand! Another one? This yeah. is where we prove yeah. ourselves! Our emotions are in two! This will be over before they know what's the best! Spin it! Cut it! Top of them! Make what would be happening to you? Go ahead! Here we go! Gotcha! Why not? Spin! Cut it! Why not? Great! You don't stand a chance to get spin it! Top of them! Let us make you shot now! Another one of these blastest things, of course. Yeah. 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 <laughs> that diversion turned out to be a lot longer than I had expected. Let's show him a thing or three. Blasted birds Dora just kept on swooping in on Rex, Rex, his feet. Our emotions are in tune, Rex. I like your attitude. Rolling smash. Let's go. Ha. So fast. Yeah, I can't get out of here. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, why did I not get the crust of chitin from that one? Uh, well, that's irritating. Alright, let's go back to the tree. Oh, wrong menu. And where you? Let us go. So Wait a second, they're all back? Huh. Okay, I guess skip travel causes them to respawn. Hmm. Well, that's handy. No! We lost the upper hand! Rolling smash! Yeah, if you can hit him with break, I would really appreciate it. No, you're not going to make it, are you? We'll finish this guy off first. Okay, there we go. Alright, so... Skip travel, back to Fonsamima. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's nowhere closer than just the front gate. I guess it's not too far away. We just need to go get... We just need to go talk to that artist guy. Now just go. Speaking of which... There we go, right over here. About to say, where is she? Ah, this is exactly what I require. Magnificent. You have assisted me greatly. With this, I can complete my work. And what do you do when it's complete? I'm hoping to sell my wares to a noble named Isolde. Isolde has a special love for landscapes, and the one I'm working on now will be irresistible to her. If she buys it, then I won't have to keep skipping lunch for want of coin. Ah. Uh, I haven't given you your reward yet. Here, I'm sure this will come in handy one day. Thanks. No, no, thank you. Do come back. I hope you'll let me paint you sometime. Okay. A bit of extra gold. And skill points and a harvest necklace. Ooh, Carver got the level two. And so did Percy. All right. A new way is open to me. All right. So, yeah, for Percival, it's just increasing trust. That's good. Give Percival lots of drinks. Perform a driver combo. <laughs> I do that a lot. But I haven't actually been able to finish a driver combo yet. I've got as far as launch, but I don't have a convenient art to perform smash. Defeat a water hilm. I actually got attacked by two just now. And of course it doesn't count because he didn't have his key affinity available at the time. 
Blast it. Finish an enemy. Collect an HP potion. Defeat Igna enemies in Oriya. Well, there's certainly a lot of those. But first, I have to do this finish an enemy thing. Leaping. Okay, Percival has leaping. Poppy has that also. Uh, those Letting those two team up will definitely come in handy. So Percival wants to use drinks for leaping and also for Dark Serpent. What exactly is Rex using right now? He's on Narsapair Jelly. Yeah. Well, I can deal with this later. I actually want to check this out. Oh, yeah, I do have a lot of WP weapon points. So I could upgrade some of these. Let's see here. Improve the recharge time on both Rolling Smash and Sword Bash. Sword Bash I use quite frequently. Let's go ahead and get that one. Bitballs. I've been doing a fair amount with... Um... um Boreas. HP potion spawn more damage to toppled enemies restores 25% of damage to the whole party increases damage to launched enemies yeah both brave throw and mighty ball are kind of meh in my opinion because when you have an enemy that's toppled or launched, what you really want to do is just continue with the driver combo rather than, you know, attack them with these particular arts. But Brave Throw has a higher damage ratio than Mighty Ball, so I'll keep that one. Okay, let's that one. In fact, let's just improve all three of these. And looks like I don't have anything available for the Chroma Katana set. Oh yeah, I only have 127 points. Knuckle Claws. Huh. Blow down HP potions, damage from the back, no special effects of any kind. Yeah, let's not do anything with that. Okay, so twin rings. Yeah, she's got a lot with this one. <sighs> hmm. Looks like I can only improve one. So which one? Butterfly Blade, that's her break art. More damage, that's meh. But faster recharge? Okay, let's go with Butterfly Blade. Okay, and then she's been doing a lot of bit ball lately.
increases damage to toppled enemies. Meh. It has a really fast recharge time. That could act that might actually be good for just art spamming. Dolphin Spin also has a decent recharge time. Let's go with Acrobatic Bomber, though. That's the Break Art. It does slightly shorten the recharge time. Okay. And the Knuckle Claws haven't really done anything with this one yet. Got a knockback art. Hmm. So, let's see. I want to keep this one to spawn the HP potions. That's the launch art. Definitely want to keep that one. This is just a straightforward damage art. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to trade out Jackal Claw for Raptor Beat. No, not strengthen it. I want to move it. Because for a healer, doing damage isn't really important. But the knockback reaction, that could actually be pretty helpful. Let's go ahead and strengthen that one. Okay. And now Tora, your drill shield. Okay, and I can strengthen one more. Increases aggro drawn from driver arts. That's definitely useful. Increases damage by 100% when HP is 30 or less. Eh. Since he's the tank, he'll be taking quite a few hits, so yeah, his HP will j tend to drop. Steady drill. Increased damage to launched enemies. Again, meh. Let's just improve Spinning Cutter. A little bit more damage. And... Increase Aggro Draw. For a tank, that's definitely helpful. Okay, he has a Launch Art. Yeah, I just don't have a smash art, so I can't complete the driver combo. Hmm. Okay, evasion, sure. Did I check Korra's affinity chart? I keep getting caught up in tangents. Aha! I didn't. Oh, she got. Being with a driver means team. constant progress. My conversation skills have improved. I mean, I did. Me, yes. <laughs> so she's got level two of girls talk. <laughs> Condition. Talk a lot. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Alright then. So, where's the playhouse? Up there. Okay. Ludwig. 
I hear there's this blade called the Aegis has been resurrected. If the program at my Momo Playhouse is anything to go by, it's the one that destroyed all rest 500 years ago. There's been a public notice issued by the Orion Army about it, telling us to stay vigilant. Apparently we're to be on the lookout for a green core crystal. Hmm. Well, I'm not going to bother much about it. <laughs> Another sweet shot. Recharge arts by point two. Point two. Better than point one, but it's still kind of meh. On the other hand, cho bitter chocolate is going to come in handy eventually, so let's just get some anyway. Not like I can't afford it. Alright. I just wasted a lot of time playing around with my blades. Yeah, there's Iona. If you're looking for Grandpa, he's in the last room at the end of the corridor. You should just go say hi to him, Mr. Bandom. I think he'd like that. Well, we will take care of that, but in the next episode, because I spent a bit too much time on my blades. So, yeah, it's time to end the video. Thank you very much for watching, viewers. I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 2 as we head back and talk to Iona's grandpa, a.k.a. Vandom's friend, a.k.a. the person who's supposed to be able to get us to the World Tree. See you then!